Welcome back in the kitchen again with another one with Chef Ricardo cooking show guys amazing to be in the kitchen giving your favorite recipes and ideas and things that you love to make in the kitchen anyway I want to simply say to you I got some recipe and this recipe is amazing the flavor the texture and everything is awesome I want you guys to tune in watch the video leave your comments in the description box because we got so much recipe for you guys it's gonna it's just like more than tongue it's heaven in the mouth let's get to there uh, anyway, remember to visit my website, chefrecorder.co.uk, and also pop over to my website, all right? Remember to pop over to the website, chefrecorder.co.uk, and also remember to leave your comments in the description, click in the notification bell, leave your comments, tell a friend, and a friend, tell a friend. Big up on yourself, and my respect goes for you every time. Stay blessed. See you next time. Bye. -bye. going to be Thai red curry fit chicken okay so this is a kit right here guys as you can see it's a pack if it just use a hand and just simple pull it apart this is the coconut milk you need this and you need this and you need this three ingredients come in the kit all right so this is the herb which you also need all right so if you go to a local shop or a supermarket please pick up yourself a pack of red Thai curry kit you can make some curry chicken at home so if you simple Tear off a little bit and that's simple. Let's put this inside of it. That's the herb, the herb, the mixed herb, not the Jamaican herb. We are talking about season for seasoning your meat. All right, guys, don't get it too rough. So if you use it and marinate up your meat, you know what I mean, your chicken, then you will see. All right. So let me just rub it up. It got everything in it. If you read. If you read the information behind of the curry kit, you will see exactly what I'm talking about. The chicken, I'm just showing you how to marinate it, not to cook it. And next, I'm going to put the link on my YouTube channel, how to cook it. All right, now I got a few curry, I got a few, no, not curry, I got a few few garlic which I'm going to be using if you don't have one of these garlic press you need to get one they add chef ricotta website chef ricotta that color tk all you're gonna do is just press down on it simple a lot of garlic here all right look at that roughly about more than a tablespoon of a garlic nice one so once you The garlic with the chicken honestly you will see exactly what I'm talking about all right now what I'm gonna do is it's gonna be as I said once you put the that beautiful garlic and also the garlic with the 
with the chicken you will see exactly what I'm talking about all right guys so yeah definitely 100% you'll see exactly how that come out so lovely and nice so the garlic the chicken and the, and the herb now what I'm going to do is get the paste all right this is the paste this is the red Thai green red paste red curry paste Thai so we're gonna simply squeeze out this inside of it This is a red curry paste. Honestly, it's, it's amazing, guys. You, sh you have to try this one. Honestly, I did a video back then with this one, but a lot of people request it again, and I decided to, you know what I mean, give them a latest update. All right, that looking good, isn't it? Amazing. That looking fantastic nice and lovely so all I'm going to do is rub up the paste with the chicken nice one it's looking amazing already so amazing and honestly it is fantastic i'm gonna put some garlic this is some dry herb don't worry yourself about this one guys you don't have to you don't mean that because i have it i'm just gonna be using it a bit some black pepper Look a bit of all purpose season. Wow, wow, hold on. This is some chicken season. I'm gonna put a teaspoon of chicken season. This is some more mixed herb, not the Jamaican herb, guys. Don't get it wrong. I'm gonna put a teaspoon of the mixed herb. I mean, don't want you guys to get this thing wrong, you know. All right, I'm gonna put some spring onion. I'm just showing you guys how to marinate this Thai green curry. Red curry, I mean. I don't know why I keep saying green. It's red. I know it's red. Red green curry and Thai green curry. The red one and the other inside of it. Nice one. What we're going to do is mix it up like this. And I'm 
using like you can use chicken breast or you can use also chicken thigh you don't need any salt all right guys yeah. nice one all right now let's put it into a different container just gonna put it into another container like this I just do it in the glass bowl that so you guys can see exactly what I'm doing so that's the red Thai curry chicken how to marinate it if you want to see how I cook it I'll, I have a video on my YouTube channel I'm gonna put the link in the description box see that look at that that look so fantastic and an amazing red Thai curry chicken how to marinate it and prepare it and also get it ready for cook all right so the next video i'm gonna cook it and i will i have a video on my youtube channel i put the link in the description box but i'll just leave it again because a lot of people don't understand the red thai curry chicken so I just give them some more tips and ideas on it please enjoy and subscribe leave your comments in the description box but the one thing i want to say to you with this you can simply marinate it and put it down in your freezer for at least three to four weeks. You can put it into your fridge and cook it the next day. All right, I love everyone on your stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. Watch more video from Chef Fukarati. See you next time in the kitchen with a lot more recipe, guys. It's fantastic and an amazing. All right, and stay tuned. Nice, I love you guys. So basically, right in this pan, I have some pork which I'm going to marinate. Easy one and simple. I'm not going to cook it. I'm just going to show you how to marinate it. If you want to cook it, it's easy to cook. You know, just straight up, put in the oven and cook it for an hour. Right? Nice and lovely. So, I'm going to marinate it up now. i make you guys get the full 100 of how to marinate your meat at home. Alright, let's start into it. All purpose season. All right, of about a teaspoon of all purpose season. This is some garlic and tomato. This is dry herb. You, if you don't have it, don't stress yourself. Nice one. I'm gonna put roughly about two teaspoons of ketchup. Yeah, that's amazing. This is some garlic and salt mixed together. All right, just gonna put half teaspoon. Some paprika. Yeah. And this is some spring onion.
white onion. I got some garlic. I got a rough about five cup of garlic here. Alright. If you don't have this, you need to get it. It's a garlic press and it is on Chef Ricardo website. If you go to chefricardo.co.uk, you can get this garlic press. Press your garlic, it's better for you. All right, mother, yeah. Chop up, chop up with the knife. This come in really handy and your garlic come out lovely and nice. All right, guys. So, yeah, things looking good. Um, Yeah, I got some mix herb, can put some mix herb on it not the Jamaican herb put a teaspoon on it, you know what I mean bring the flavor also so let's rub it up This is amazing. Look at that. That is just lovely and nice. So simple. If you have some time, you can put some time on it. Yeah. So that look nice? Yeah, perfect. That's what I'm talking about. Perfect. You know what I mean? Yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect. Perfect marinated, you know what I mean? Yeah, look at that. Nice and lovely. And so easy and simple. So yeah, please subscribe, leave your comments, tell a friend. And a friend, tell a friend. I have a lot more recipes and a lot more ideas will be coming from Chef Ricardo and team. So as you can see it for yourself, that's exactly what we're talking about. How to marinate your meat at home. All right guys, yeah, nice one. See you next time in the kitchen with more recipe. I'll give you some tips now. With this meat, you can wrap it and put it in your freezer for about three to four weeks. And also you can put it into your fridge and cook it the next day your option all right guys i love every one of you stay tuned and i will see you next time in the kitchen with a lot more recipes from chef Ricardo all right see you next time bye bye